Hey, what is up guys? Mr. Reverts here. And today I want to show you guys how you can earn a free base weapon for Call of Duty World War II multiplayer just for pre-ordering the game at a local GameStop. Now, with the pre-order bonus, it's called the Multiplayer Upgrade Pack, and you also get a total of 4 hours of double XP and like I said, a free base weapon in multiplayer. Now, some of you guys may have already known about this pre-order bonus, and I actually would like to discuss what they mean by base weapon in just a bit, but uh, I wanted to bring this to y'all's attention in case some of you guys may not have known about this because World War 2 is coming up just around the corner in just a few weeks here the game is finally going to be released and if you're planning on going hard when the game finally comes out I think this is the best pre-order bonus you can get. Now guys like I said in the pre-order bonus you are going to be able to unlock a free base weapon in multiplayer and by base weapon they just mean the plain vanilla version of the weapon at least that's what it's been like for the past three years but I saw on Twitter Ali was saying that this ad basically confirms weapon variants in World War 2 and if you're wondering does that mean stat changing weapons well at this point we actually don't know because down the line there is still a very good possibility of weapon variants added to supply drops but Kanji did confirm that all weapon variants will simply be cosmetic but at some point down the line I could definitely see weapon variants that are not just cosmetic added to multiplayer or at least more weapons that are only obtainable through supply drops because when Modern Warfare Remastered was out Raven Software did not have the whole supply drop depot and I think they said that there wouldn't be any weapons in supply drops everything was just simply cosmetic but then that changed and then back in black ops 3 the game started out with just simply cosmetic items only and then later on multiplayer weapons were added so i'm not just going to be surprised if weapons are going to be coming to world war 2 multiplayer i think it's definitely a good possibility so my advice to you guys would be to just consider all options here again i know michael country did say that there are no stat changing weapons but later on down the line there could be variants that are not just cosmetic only however the good Good news is he did say that everything can be earned without opening supply drops so there's that to take away here but there has not been any word about supply drops or a quartermaster or anything like that since this summer I believe and I think there won't be any more information given out to us about that subject until the game finally releases because if they disclose all that information and the details about the supply drop system then obviously some people might just cancel their pre-orders and not buy the game at all now guys before I head off here I'd like to apologize for not posting any content for a few days I've had a lot going on in life right now recently with school and work and then my grandma's house also got broken into a few weeks ago and we've been dealing with a lot of stuff right now but uh, I promise I'm still here I'm not gonna leave you guys for a while without any content and I do plan on going hard when World War 2 finally comes out in just a few weeks here so guys that's it for the video if you guys did enjoy then drop a like and uh, let me know your thoughts about the supply job content and this pre-order bonus in the comment section down below thank you so much for watching I'm a very have a great rest of the day till next time I'll see you guys later